welcome to our final etude. Since you've come to the end of the term, I'll be reviewing the exam material with you myself. Is everyone here? I see Miss Duck is absent. No matter if she intends to fail so that she can marry me. First, let us consider the opera Ruslan and Ludmilla. Who can tell me the composer and the author of the poem it was based on? Mikhail Glinka composed the opera based on the poem by Alexander Pushkin. Correct, Mr. Chihuahua. Pushkin is often hailed as the founder of modern Russian literature. Glinka influenced the music of five Russian composers who came to be known as the Mighty Handful. Who were they, Miss Andy Tarina? Mili Balakirev, Modus Mussorgsky, Nikolai Rimsky Korsakov, Alexander Borodin, and. and. Tchaikovsky! You got four. The mighty handful thought Tchaikovsky's music too Western to include him in their group. The fifth was Cesar Cui. Next, we'll look at Camille Saint Saëns' Danse Macabre. Saint Saëns' Dance of Death was based on a poem by Henri Casali, which portrayed death as a fiddler leading people to their graves. The composer employed squirtatura tuning on the violin. Who knows what that is? Beside you, Mr. Autor. From the Italian formis tuning, scoratura means deliberate non-standard tuning. While the violin's four strings are normally tuned G, D, A, E, Sansin flatted the E string for danse macabre. Very good, Miss Boanita. Although there are a number of musical compositions relating to William Shakespeare's Romeo and Juliet, we will look at Sergei Prokofiev's ballet. Choreographic problems delayed its premiere. When did it finally show? <laughs> That's right, 1938. <laughs> now, Prokofiev started playing piano at the age of five. What was his other passion, Mr. Armadillon? Um, soccer? Nah. <laughs> no, uh, no. The correct answer is chess, which Prokofiev learned to play at seven. At last, we come full circle to the Nutcracker. We're running short on time, so a quick overview should suffice. The original ballet is so long, most companies produce a shortened version or suite. What other Tchaikovsky ballet premiered with the Nutcracker on December 18th, 1892? Violenta. Correct, Mr. Batson. And for extra credit, what new instrument was used for the dance of the Sugar Plum Fairy at Tchaikovsky's insistence? No one? Very well. It was the Celesta. Ah, Miss Duck. You finally decided to join us. I forgot my book, so I had to run back and get it. And... Perhaps you would be induced to come on time if I woke you up every morning. That is to say, if we live together in marriage. I'm sorry, Mr. Cat. I'll study hard. I promise I won't fail the exam. I'll have my tuxedo ready just in case. Class 